in this video I'm going to be unboxing the February Accio box and in this box you're going to receive indie handmade items that are also vegan and cruelty free. This month's box theme was something to do with quotes and next month's box theme is book one so Sorcerer's Stone, Philosopher's Stone, whichever title you call it is going to be the theme for next month and if you're interested in that I'm going to leave all the pricing information and other details you may want to know in the description box. If you use my code Demi Seriously, it'll save you 15% off your first box of a month-to-month -month subscription. They already posted a spoiler for next month, and it's, spoiler alert, it's going to be a t-shirt, but I'm not gonna post the design. You can go check out their Instagram if you wanna see a spoiler, the design for the t-shirt. Their t-shirts are very soft, so I'm excited to get another t-shirt next month. So let's get into it. Okay, I already see the spoiler that they posted on their Instagram for last month. They posted a spoiler for this month, you know what I mean. It is a Howler scarf. How do I get into this? I thought they're, oh there you go. Okay, it is a Howler scarf that is so cute. When I saw the picture of this on Instagram, I was like, oh, it's gonna look so awesome. I have a Howler backpack and I can, you know, it would be a great little outfit <laughs> and it's a nice thin scarf I live in a place where it's you know hot all the time so this will be perfect to wear and it's like comfortable and not too hot to wear especially living in Florida it's so pretty I, I'm not gonna get it in frame but you know what it says <laughs> you know what it says right but it's, it's, it's so cute I love anything having to do with the howler I love it. So pretty. Next we have, oh, another spoiler. They they posted a, a spoiler in like their newsletter. I got an, in, in an email and it's this tin that says, have a biscuit, Potter. <laughs> that is so cute. I love that part in the books where, you know, Harry mouths off to <laughs> Umbridge and Umbridge sends him to McGonagall's office and, you know. Have a biscuit, Potter. I probably won't put biscuits or any food in here. I think I'm gonna put um, tea, my tea bags in here as storage. I think that'd be really cute. But I love this. That's adorable. Next, we have a bookmark. I think it has. This is the um, house-related item for this month. They always include at least one, and it says those cunning folk use any means to achieve their ends. I should know that by heart because, you know, I'm a Slytherin. This is such a cute design. I love the snake on it. So cool. And it's, it's it kind of looks like it's made out of wood. That's so unique. And it says Ink and Wonder. That's their site. So you can check them out if you want one of these and you didn't get this month's box. They'll probably have that on their site, maybe. But I'm excited to look at the other houses and how their designs came out because this is really cool. And it looks like it's made out of actual wood. It has that kind of texture. It's not paper. Like, you know, the regular cardstock, you know, that they usually put uh, bookmarks on. I think that's really unique and I love that design. And then it looks like we have a journal and it says, Words are, in my not-so-humble opinion, our most inexhaustible source of magic with some elder wands there. And of course, if you're doing a quotes themed box, you have to include a Dumbledore quote because he has some of the best quotes in the series. And that's my opinion. <laughs> they have a little uh, pen or pencil holder thing there. So that's uh, nice. It's like it has this, like, this uh, turquoise, teal, aqua sort of color. I don't know what color you would call that, I guess, in between of all those three that I just named. <laughs> Uh, and then it has a little strappy thing to keep the book, the journal closed. And it has lined paper. I prefer lined paper. Unless I was drawing or something, which I don't draw, I would prefer blank if I was doing that. But, you know, this is a standard sort of journal. Oh, look, it even has a little thing so you can have a, a place saver. That's cute. I like that. And then the last item on the bottom looks like a metal, it is a metal tin sort of 
poster, which these are my favorite kinds of posters, and it says, anything's possible if you've got enough nerve. And that is really nice and, you know, something inspiring to hang up. So if you're lacking inspiration, then this will be really nice to have up. And I love the color scheme, black and white. You can't go wrong with that. <laughs> So let's take a look at the spoiler card. Oh, iconic quotes. I think I was saying famous quotes. Well, same thing. <laughs> so we have a howler scarf, which is adorable. I can't wait to wear with my howler book bag. And I might wear like a Weasley shirt or something like that. And it'll just be a cute little outfit. I'm glad that it's light, you know, because living in Florida, you don't really tend to wear scarves too much. But these type of scarves, they're airy and light. So you can get away with it. And then have a biscuit cookie tin. Well, I can't be putting cookies in here because I'm trying to go back on a diet and I can't be having any cookies. <laughs> but I'll probably put like my tea bags in here or maybe like pencils or pens or something like that. Doesn't have to be biscuits. And then we have anything's possible if you got enough nerve metal sign i love metal signs it just gives it something extra instead of the usual poster and then the sorting song wood mark so it is made of wood that's so pretty it doesn't have all the de designs on there but that's the hufflepuff one they do have all of them obviously so you can check that out on their their website there if you're interested in getting your house and then the words are magic sustainable journal with art by lupin lettering so you can follow them on instagram and yeah that is it i hope you enjoyed this video comment down below and let me know what your favorite item was this month i think i thought the scarf might be my favorite but i don't know this tin they're both everything's great but these two items are amazing and i'm happy to have them in my collection i think this takes the cake though i just love that that part in the books it's it is iconic it's an iconic moment in the series so thanks for watching